Hello, uh, Jim Howard here in uh, Fort Worth, Texas. Today it's uh, October 10th, 2010. So it's 10, 10, 10, or 10, 10, 2010. Uh, I was asked, I use a Webcam Max uh, a program, a, a webcam program, and it has other things you can do with it. And I, some of you have seen my video where I have the in-screen picture of me, and then the rest of the screen I show a web page or something like that. So people are asking how I did it. I'm not sure I'll be able to show you how. I'm going to try. It's easy to do, just, you know, yeah, especially if I'm going to try to show you, it probably won't work. But anyway, Webcam Max, uh, you can try it for 30 days for free. Uh, or you can purchase it and if you purchase it there's the unlimited package uh, which includes some other things for $89.85 you can purchase for Webcam Max the lifetime per, uh, license for $49.95 so it's 50 bucks or you can purchase it for you know a one year license, two year license or whatever also if you have a website or um, well not just a website you can actually get it for free and it wouldn't be too hard at all so you can find out at their website the way you do it would be to get it for free would be to write a review of it and post it on your uh, on your website and then let them know about it and so on and so on so that's so now let's um, let me minimize this there there I am hello now I'm going to show you first I already have um, I've saved uh, what I did so someplace here let's see is this it effects template over here see over here we have the effects template here so now up here I've saved two of them and I think it's this one here I've got it named area of desktop with PIP picture in picture so I'm going to double click this and there we are now why isn't my picture up here in the right hand corner? I do not know. So, okay, I guess I'll just have to show you. So I'm going to, okay, we have the desktop here. So then I, over here, here you have your camera. If I click on this, you see the end of the video, you see the video and record the video. So I'm going to go back, and the next one is, uh, I forget what it is. And the next one, I think, is the desktop. Yeah, so we'll click on the desktop here. There's the desktop. Now you have the option of, you know, the entire screen. You have all kinds of options um, that you can do, or a part of the, how big is the screen, or you can, the, the way I usually do it is, you can uh, click on a uh, web browser. I need to start, maybe, I bet that's it. Maybe I need to start the web browser. And just move this over here and I'll have it on the screen. Back to this, let's see. Okay, so we're doing the screen instead of the uh, camera. So go down here to picture in picture and double click that. Now, There, whoops, wait a minute, there we go. Ah, so now I've clicked up on, so over here we have these options, the, sort of the same ones. So we want to go over to where it says picture or camera. And there I am. Now, you can take and, uh, take and drag this to where you want it. You can resize it. So you may have seen a video, for some reason I uh, had it up in the corner and it cut my head off. So from now on I'll probably be doing a little lower down. Now, um, now that's set up correctly. Now, I don't know why it didn't work or what I did wrong. Maybe nothing, but once you have it set up the way you want it. Well, I haven't got it the way I want it yet. So let me click on desktop here. Now let me go up here and click on desktop. This is it. Oops. Cancel. 
click on desktop. That's not working. What am I doing wrong? Well, I don't want to make this video too long. So to, and what you would do is you would click on the effects here. So, okay, here it is, yeah. And then over here, save it. And uh, you decide on a name. Then you would save it over here. Then it would be set up the way you want it when you come back. And you wouldn't have to go through this procedure again. Now, let me get to live cam source. That's what we have now. Uh, play media. You can actually uh, bring a video here and, and play a video and you can be up in the corner. You can moderate it. Or you can have the de all types of things you can do. Capture the screen, which we're doing. Here's the picture in picture. Uh, but I wanted to get over here. Let me go back to capture the screen. Close that. That's not working. Oh, I bet there's some type of a warning message or something underneath this. Save effects. Okay. Maybe I had one, several of those open. Let me move this here. Nope. Nothing there. What I wanted to do was show you, and okay, we have it on the P and P now. Let's go to capture screen source. There. Okay, now up here you have it. You know whether you want to follow the cursor or whether you want to uh, show the cursor at all. Now, what I want to do is bring this, bring a window back up here. Okay. Now, what you'll want to do, probably, you have a number of choices. You can specify the window or an area, or you can do full screen. So probably what you're going to want to be doing is specify a uh, area. No. That's if you want to set up a size. So we want to, I've never even done that. Specify a window. You have this button here that says select. So what you do is just drag it over. And now the blue color, I don't know if you can see it or not, is around the browser window. So now, whatever I bring up on this browser will be what's on the screen. So let me double check here. There we are. Now keep in mind, you can change your location of this video. You're in picture in picture. You can change the location of it. You can drag it, you know, to a different corner. And there's even a setting over here where you can uh, do those sorts of things. And you can also save this once you got it the way you want it. So here's the effect template. And then you would uh, go up here. This is it. To save template. Then let's give it a name. And we'll, I'm just going to call this test. And click here to include the source. And click OK. And now you've saved it up here. Now that's basically it. And I don't want to make this video too long. Uh, maybe I'll come back sometime and, and uh, add more and show the other features and the other things that you can do. By the way, some of you are, I'm sure, experts at this. Uh, if you are, please make a video for us. And uh, what, do we, what do we call it on YouTube here? Add it, a video response or whatever. Submit it, and uh, I'll prove it, you know. And maybe you can do one on different uh, parts of Webcam Max. Maybe we can have a little corner here of it. So let me do this before I go. Let me go and just... Oh, I want to close... Let me close down uh, picture in picture. I don't think I did close it down, did I? Oh, I know reset. That's it. Down here, clear all. OK. 
Okay, I cleared all, and I want just my picture to show. I want you to see me. What did I do wrong? Let's go over here. Okay, let me clear again. Clear all selected. Here's picture in picture. Here's screen capture. We got that. Here's play media. Now, there we are. Voila! Success. Sort of. Yeah, you're going to have to play with it a little bit. And I I very, I don't use it that often, and I, I, I haven't learned it all that well myself. So I uh, just wanted to give you a sample because a couple, a couple of people ask. So I hope this helps out. If not, somebody else will hopefully leave comments. Somebody else will maybe leave some links to, to other YouTube videos that probably show you how to do it great. And uh, I'll be looking forward to looking at those links myself. So from Fort Worth, Texas, Cowtown in North Texas. Uh, see you later. You know what? I'm not using this program to record this. I'm using another program. I'm using uh, whatever it is I need to